Hey, what's up everyone? I'm back with another video and today I'm going to be doing something different. It's not basketball, it's not uh, baseball, um, it's, not, it's not no sports cards, nothing sports related. Um, I mean, I guess you can call Beyblade sport, I would say. Um, I, I know there's tournaments, so I mean, you still compete. Anyway, uh, do you have an unboxing and this came from eBay. Um, really excited to get this because um, First of all, this this blade right here is really tough to find, uh, so I'm gonna go and unbox it. And let me just I want to save this box. I don't want to ruin it. I know there's people who ruin boxes and throw them away, but if you're a reseller, you can save it. And all, I love the way they package this. Like, wow, they put a lot of peanuts. Pretty nice. Here we have a lot of peanuts. I know you guys are hungry right now. At least some of you. Look at that. Wow. All right, just get this out of the way. Is that a sit block bag? Kinda. Oh wow, look at that, that's awesome. Nothing else. Pretty cool. All right, so here we have um, the eBay seal. Just to close off these little packages. Uh, let's see. Man, this looks nice. All right. So one thing about this Beyblade is that it looks like this is the um, international version. Or at least not the American version. Uh, this is most likely a uh, the Spanish version, so I believe this this could be the South American or maybe the uh, Spanish. You know, Spain. Um, that's what I'm thinking because San. What does it say? San Born. I have no idea what store that is. If you, if any of you guys, any of you guys know what store this is, comment below because I have no clue what a Sandborn is. But it looks like it was twelve dollars. Um, so I don't know where they picked it up from, but anywho, it's in Spanish. Um, so this uh, Grip Attacker, one of the uh, first released in the series. Um, like I said, it's really, really rare. Um, if you find one right now, they would be probably. A little over a hundred dollars, so uh, it came with the well, not the stickers, but I guess what's left over the stickers. Uh, you do have this little interest in Bit Beast, uh, which is like a secondary bit chip uh, that you get usually. And uh, well, that's not the new generation, but the old generation. Um, I used to think this was like a Falborg or something, I don't know what kind of beast that is. Um, and you need to get these little stickers on here. Um, I remember putting these on the base stadiums or the launchers. Here's the little instructions. Nobody reads that anyway. Uh, it looks like this is brand new. Hasn't been used. Um, or maybe it's just like that because it's, um, it's bent in the box. Uh, here's the remaining of the stickers. Uh, more instructions. I like the animation on this, like, it's pretty anime. <laughs> yeah, so it tells you how to use it properly and all that bullshit, but... Anyways, um, here's the launcher. This is the old classic. It looks like this is actually the, um, the original launcher. Yeah, this is brand new. It's like, hasn't even used. Look at that. Not even used. So, uh, now the top, it is uh, the Dragoon Bed Beast. This is uh, one of the major Bed Beasts in the series, the main one, the top one. Um, of course, uh, the owner of the Bed Beast is Tyson. Um, so, really, really popular top. It's got the grip on the bottom. And this, this is, oh man, this is just so retro looking. By the way, this is a uh, throwback since it's Thursday. So 
in pretty great shape, unbelievable. I've seen some people selling these online and they're in really bad shape. Like, I mean, not really bad shape, but they have like missing stickers and whatnot. So, let's take a look. Inside, yeah, it's 2001, 2002. This one, these are really old. All right, so, um, yeah, pretty awesome top. I will do a test launch with these. Um, nothing else in the box. Um, you do have um, some other interesting ads uh, on here or um, displays, whatever, like the Spark Knight, um, Ultimate Sizo. I think that is Ultimate Sizo. And this bouncy one, I think there's a bouncy Beyblade. Um, I think that's a customized Beyblade. Um, it's kind of like the Chief's Beyblade for the, for the series, the Chief, Kenny. Here are the stats. So, nothing more. Um, yeah, this this uh, new series is like, um, I mean, it's not that popular like it used to be, but um, I do miss a lot of plastics. I wish they would uh, continue making plastics. Um, I understand that, you know, like new generations um, are, you know, starting with the new series, uh, with new generations like Burst. Um, but, I mean, it's, if they would go back to the plastics, that would be amazing. I know there were some Beyblades that were never released. I think I said this in a different video I made. Um, and these Beyblades, for example, the um, uh, Mar Myris Galax, I believe it was never released. Um, I think I've seen some pictures online of one of them, but I think that was just uh, uh, like a custom one somebody made. Um, what else? Uh, like the Dark Bladers, uh, for example, those Dark Bladers, Beyblades. Um, um, I know the Wolfstorm and the, um, what was the other one? Uh, there was this Dracula one, I forgot, but, I mean, the Wolfstorm, it was a really good looking Beyblade from the Dark Bladers. I wish they would have released that one, but, you know, some people were saying, oh, it's because, you know, they they look pretty difficult to make, um, like Unicolium and, and what was the other one? Um, uh, man, I forgot the name. Um, I know they released the Sal Salmolean. Uh, and Grifolian and Philian, there we go, and Philian, that was a recase. So, you see this Beyblade right here, this is for new, new generation. As you guys can see, it's got like a sword or something, I don't know what it is, like arrows or a sword. It makes you wonder how come Hasbro never did this, or at least Takara, because uh, you know they were the main ones uh, producing the Beyblades. How come they never released those? old-fashioned Beyblades, like, you know, like the, from the first generation. It was not that they were difficult to make, or maybe you would think, maybe they didn't have the technology or enough technology to make those Beyblades, but it's still a mystery what, they were never released, but these Beyblades right here look like, holy shit, like some, something uh, from the year, you know, 3000 or something, like futuristic, like this is the next level shit. Um, I mean, these guys, um, who is this? Sutron, Z2, Excalius. I mean, these are cool names. I'm not gonna say, but there's some that I saw and I picked up a few. Um, I did order a box from uh, a supplier, some dude. Uh, we kind of, you know, make business together and we sell stuff, resell. But he's a plant with a box filled with Beyblades. Um, I know there's a few that have some stupid ass names like. Um, like Guinan, I have no idea what they put these names. Um, is that Ephrater? Ephrater? Like, seriously, what, I don't know what the hell they were smoking uh, when they decided to name these Beyblades. Uh, there's some more in here somewhere. I mean, they have a lot of freaking Beyblades. I know the Valtric sounds pretty cool. Like, it looks pretty pretty nice. The Valtric right there. Um, Kerberos makes you think of. Um, Cerberus. Um, not this one. Um, I mean, I have a lot of these. Let me show you guys the box. So, I mean, this is. Oh, not this one. Like Odex. Okay, so Odex sounds, I don't know, kind of weird. Um, <laughs> Dooms Ezra, okay, I can, I can tell you that Dooms Ezra looks. It's pretty cool and sounds sounds pretty badass. Um, 
There's a one right there, and there's a one Veltrick. I mean, there's a shit load of Beyblades in here. Um, another Odex, and uh, there's the Wyvern, like, seriously. Do you mean Wyvern, or what's a Wyvern? I'm sorry, I'm sorry if I don't know what a Wyvern is. Uh, Nepstries and Rock to War. I don't know, I mean, these names where they came from. They sound like some planetary stuff. Um, SpaceX type of shit. Uh, Unicrest. Uh, there's one. Oh man, where is it? Oh, I think it's this one right here, actually. It's called. Um, okay, so. Jor. Germontor. Germontor or something like that. Like what the fuck? Like seriously, I don't know what the hell they were they were smoking or they were doing or thinking uh, when they named these. Like, I have no clue what a freaking Jamontor is, but okay, it's just a Beyblade, I guess. Um, and there's one called the 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 the, the uh, Vipire or some shit. Um, I think it's this one. Um, something about a vampire, uh, Vipire. I don't know what it's called, but. Um, yeah, I mean, we're gonna do a test launch in these. Um, all right, I'm back. Sorry, this is what happened. <laughs> so I had to uh, change rip course. All right, so we're gonna do the test battle, and I'm gonna use the uh, bearing stinger, one of my favorite ones. Rip attacker. No surprise if he flies out of the stadium. Trip protector. Oh, come on, come on, this wind, come on! Come on, Dragoon! Oh, no! Well, I'm. Come on, I'm using an endurance type, so. That's why I'm starting at first. That was a fail. Alright, second battle, look at that! Whoa! And he's out. One more battle. Let's see who wins the last one. Come on, do your magic, Dragoon. Let's do this! Take him out! Wow. I think Dragoon's gonna lose. Yes, he did. So that's pretty much it for Grip Attacker and the Baron Singer. Infamous Baron Singer. Okay, guys, so um, I think that's it. Um, yeah, these names are really like. When I first, um, I mean, read these names from all these big lips to stores, um, I was like, holy crap. Um, but yeah, there's uh, so many freaking Beyblades in here. Uh, some of them are like in bad shape, like these boxes aren't, they're not in top conditions. Uh, top condition here, and... I mean, there's... I don't know, um, so many freaking Beyblades. Uh, this guy here is supplying me with a fake box. Um, I said before, we go 50-50 on um, some of the stuff, so... There's a lot of freaking Beyblades here. Hold on. Yeah. All of those are Beyblades. So. Yeah, there's so many funny looking ones. Um, oh my god. Like, I, I always think of constellations when I read these. Unicrest, um, this one says two dollars, um, no idea why it's two dollars or why it was two dollars. Alright, so that's pretty much it. Nothing else to show here, just a whole bunch of pile of interesting named Beyblades. <laughs> so, um, I was thinking guys, if you guys want to see more of this, uh, more of these videos, um, if you guys enjoyed this video, just um, comment, you know, just say, hey, I want to see more of these videos. Um, 
Also, um, I, I was thinking I can do like TBT, like the throwback, uh, Thursday edition. Maybe I can upload like once a week or something with the old school Beyblades. Or I can do like an old school versus uh, new school type of thing. I don't know. You guys um, decide. Uh, just, just command, whatever. So, um, with that being said, like, subscribe, share it with your friends. And I'll see you guys later.